Oh yeah, sexy biscuits. Nice. This is Kung Fu on the NES. I almost said NES, but I'm English, so it's NES. Released by Nintendo in 1985, obviously based on the arcade machine that wasn't of the same name, it was Kung Fu Master in the arcades. Released in 1984, that was made by IRM. You know IRM. They made a little kind of, you know, stonker known as our type. I just watched, um, you know, a couple of the high score challenges out there in YouTube land with my mates, and I watched Monkey Spaz's um, uh, link in the doobie down below, and he's in my channel list. Um, gameplay of the Amstrad version, and uh, my my first experience, why well, wasn't this? It was the arcade game in um, Minehead, which I thought was absolutely amazing, but I was terrible at it and then uh, when we uh, you know changed our holiday home and went to Westwood Ho I played this on the Play Choice 10 which I guess technically is my first experience of the NES at home anyway right story simple Kung Fu bloke um, obviously heavily inspired by Bruce Lee a evil group terrorist I don't know Nick your bird and you have to, you know, go through the uh, the pagoda, much like Game of Death, you know, five stages or whatever, to get her back. Why do these terrorist groups only aim low? Why are you nicking a bird and not a nuke? Anyway, let's get into it. Uh, I suck at the arcade machine. I suck at this. I was going to play the Spectrum version, but I, uh, I, I did actually film it, then looked at it and just went, I'm not going to. I'm not going to put that on the people of the world because that looks fucking terrible. And I love the Specky, so let's, you know, expose it and only good light. There's an Atari 2600 version, by the way, that came out really late, like 1987 by Activision. That's really, really impressive, but let's get into it. Was this um, a launch game? On the, it, it may have been a launch game on the NES in this country. Right. Come on. Right. Punchy, punchy motherfuckers. Right. All right. Thank you. Kiki, kiki, kiki. Oh, look at that. Yes. Right. Jump. Punch. Because obviously you've got punch and kick. You've only got the two. Oh, and then when they come in close, you kind of grapple them. Um, I don't know why they called it. Oh, bollocks, you knobhead. I called it Kung Fu and not Kung Fu Master. I don't know if it's not a true port, the arcade. Oh, bollocks. Basically, stay on your toes. The, the minute you drop your, uh, which is why I shouldn't be talking, you drop your A-game, you just get swamped. But you got to remember that as well, um, uh, early game or not, coming from things like the Atari 2600 and the ColecoVision, this must have blown people's little tits off. Fuck. Fuck. And I'm terrible at it. Right. Can I just... Oh, there's a time limit! Oh, fuck off! Now, by the way, clearly based on Bruce Lee, can I just say I'm a massive Bruce Lee fan. I think, pound for pound, he was the greatest fighter of his time. Before people say, like, oh, you're just Bruce Lee fan, you're saying that. I've read the Tao Jeet Kune Do, like, 25... No! Oh, fuck off! 25 times. And if you read that book, you'll understand that the guy was just, uh, he was phenomenal. He was inspirational, you know, and not just his martial art, you know, aspects it, 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 on life. Brilliant. Plus, you know, he bridged this amazing gap from the East to the West back in the day when he was in the States when it was still kind of, you know, racist against the Chinese. Fuck off. This is hard. Right. Leg it. Really can't talk. Seriously, you can buy it on, um, Amazon for like, I don't know, 10 quid is what I bought mine. The, the, the Tao Jeet Kune Do is one of the greatest books you'll ever read, even if you don't like martial arts. Seriously. Right. No, you don't. This time, you prick. Yeah, get some of that. Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. Shame he was, you know, um, he, he was lost so young to us. Because let's be honest, Ends of the Dragon is basically the greatest martial art movie ever made. But yes! In your balls, you prick! How do you like their apples? Or plums, I guess, if I'm punching you in the bollocks. Right. Graphically, this is brilliant for an early game. Oh, 
Oh, so satisfying. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, I didn't, I didn't. Oh, fuck. You're gonna bump me straight back to the beginning, aren't you? Yes, no. Oh, bollocks. And it was also also a great shame because I was a massive fan of Brendan Lee um, when he passed away from that tragic accident on the Crow uh, set. Right. Might be a lot less talking. Why is it pause there? Punchy, 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 bad guys from the movie Aladdin. Yes! Dare I say, this might be more difficult than the arcade. No! Oh, bollocks! Broken mistake! Shit! So I've got health at the top. Oh, crap. I'm not gonna even get off the first stage, am I? I'm a bad kung fu master. That's right, people. Keep coming. I like the fact that in this pagoda, no one trained any of the people who come to approach me, so they just overwhelm me with, like, the zombie mentality, which is... Oi! Just group of numbers. That fucking annoys me. That I dodge your knife, but yet somehow you still got a cheap shot. Right. Is that it? Hey! That's it. That's really under... Oh, it's going to say, why didn't you put the fucking steps in at the end of the bloody level? That's really underwhelming. A little bit disappointed with that. Right, shit in dragon bombs and fucking bees and crap falls from the roof right now, so you ain't gonna see much more. I'm just gonna go with my game plan, which is leg it! Yeah, piss off, dragon boy. Yeah, miss me. Oh, fuck off! Why is this game so hard? Right, jump. Oh, bollocks! Ooh! No! Oh, bees! Jump! Oh fuck, you went the other way, you lying little bastard! It's gonna... it's gonna skip to the end, isn't it? No! Oh fuck, right, slowly. Ha ha! Saw you! Wow. Oh, bollocks. I mean, really? Seriously. Anyway, I'm going to call it quits there. I just want to give you a quick gameplay, or flavour, if you will, of Kung Fu on the NES, based on Kung Fu Master by Iram in the arcades. balls horrific hard. Anyway, thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you later.